Social media is a powerful thing. Last couple of weeks, I'm seeing the stressful side of it. I've just come on here today and I've seen my friend Nick crying his eyes out. He's at breaking point. Now this is a fully grown fella who has a family around him and he is at breaking point. Now, I'm not saying that this is gonna happen. I'm not suggesting it is, but if his mental health is struggling and he's a strong person, what's gonna happen next when someone who isn't as strong what are they going to do? It could be too late. Now, whatever happened to be kind? My page is about food, weight loss, some dancing, some bad dancing, admittedly, and my animals. And that's it. That's all the only thing I ever wanted to put on it. I'm not a celebrity. I'm a TikToker with a large following. So because I've got a large following, people automatically want to try and bring that down. Now, let me just say to you, that if you hate me because of my large following, why don't you do it yourself? Because that's all I did. I sat in my council flat, I posted 15, 20 videos a day, showed people what I'm up to. And that's it. I've done the same thing as you, join, go through some videos, post. And you've got the same opportunity. I'm not media trained, I don't have a script written for me, nothing like that. I'm just a normal fella from a council flat in South East London. And you, Yes, you. If you don't like it, try and do it yourself. Nothing's going to stop you. All I want to say is learn to be kind. Now, over the next couple of weeks, people are going to just try and keep bringing me down, bringing me down, but I'm going to focus on myself. I'm going to spend this weekend doing things that I like to do, taking a little bit time off TikTok so there won't be as many videos, and I'm just going to get myself back to being Lawrence because at the moment I don't even know who Lawrence is and I wouldn't have joined this app if I'd have known it had been like this never but for those who do support me and those who have stuck by me this is why I'm still on here and if people are going to criticize me for making a living by selling some cups and from paying tax and just getting by then what do you want me to do? go back onto benefits and then what you get criticized for that or what do you want to do see me working in a supermarket because I'm unskilled um, would that make you more happy because I've never been jealous of anyone else and I wish everyone the best we all got the same opportunities and maybe some of you need to realize that rather than hate focus on your own lives be happy for one another that's what I say